Chicagoans once again reach for the stars at the Adler Planetarium. It closed when the pandemic began back in March 2020. It finally reopened today. CBS 2's Asal Razai was there for the excitement. There's lots of fun to be had here, especially for families like Jessica Quintero and her daughters who came from the western suburbs. We are very excited. We've uh, been looking forward to it for a couple of years now. And while her daughters are exploring different parts of space, Quintero tells me there's nothing better than seeing them back out in the world again, having fun and learning at the same time. It's been good. We are obviously still using a mask just for health reasons for our family, but um, yeah, back into the swing of things with sports and activities and sightseeing. Even ahead of opening day, they pre-sold 800 tickets. A lot of people here excited to be back and get a look into space. For planetarium staff like Michelle Nichols, it's been quite the comeback. Overwhelmed, grateful, excited, uh, just all sorts of emotions. I, I started crying when I saw people coming in at 9 o'clock this morning. Nichols says museums all over the world were hit hard by the pandemic, and the planetarium was no different. They laid off two-thirds of their staff, but have since hired about 30% of them back. They've also hired over 60 new employees. She says the Adler Planetarium stayed closed all this time since March 13th, 2020, for simple safety and financial reasons. It would have cost us more to be open than it would have been to stay closed uh, because of the limited capacity that we would have been allowed for quite a while during the pandemic. She says now it's almost as if they're picking up right where they left off. You see people enjoying exhibits and seeing shows. It looks and feels like it did, and that's the main thing. It doesn't feel different. Uh, it feels right. A feeling many here are getting as they explore old territory with perhaps a new perspective. Asal Razai, CBS 2 News. Adler offers a discount if you live in Illinois. It also has evening hours Wednesdays from 4 to 10, so you can look through the telescope when it is nice and dark out.